Can you believe it? We're at the end of our journey with New Look 6526. This is the last video in the Royal Wedding Sew Along series, and I'm so excited to show you both of my dresses, one of each version of the pattern. So let's start with view AB, the V-neck. I truly love the style lines of the neckline of this bodice. It is so feminine with a sweetheart detail and wide set shoulder straps. It highlights the prettiest parts of a woman's neckline. If you remember from the muslin fitting video, I needed to lower the arm side on this version a little bit, so I trimmed off a quarter inch and that was all I needed. They are now comfortable with plenty of wearing ease. The only issue I have with this dress is the skirt length. The finished measurement length on the pattern envelope indicates that this is supposed to be two inches longer than it actually ended up. I'm not sure if that's a misprint or if there was an error on my part somehow, but the length is a little too short for my liking, and the queen would definitely not approve. So I might end up adding a four inch hem band. The pattern is already broken up with the midriff band, so I don't think another band would be too disruptive. Now for view CD. This is easily one of my favorite makes of all time. In terms of pattern and fabric combos, it's a knockout. The pleated wrapped bodice is also flattering, but in a more modest way. This is not one of those wrap bodices that's going to show all of your cleavage. It's very comfortable and appropriate for whatever is on your agenda, whether that's a day at the office or brunch with your girlfriends. You'll notice that the length of the skirt on this dress is a little longer, and that's because I cheated and used quarter inch seam allowances at the waistline and a half inch hem allowance. So I ended up getting one and a quarter inches in additional length. In the future, no matter which version I'm making, I'll add four inches to the length and shorten line on the skirt pattern pieces. So there you have it. I really love both of my dresses and can see myself making many more of them in the future. I can't wait to see your versions of New Look 6526 either. Please tag me in any pictures that you post online. I'd love to see them. Additionally, McCall's and Simplicity, the sponsors of this sew along, announced the giveaway prize for the contest. Up for grabs is a $1,500 brother sewing machine and five sewing patterns. There's a link in the description box with all of the contest details. You have until May 18th to enter, so there's still plenty of time if you're interested. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!